There's Nibbles. There's Nibbles. He's going to his little house. And that's one of the three stooges. There's three of them and they love to play together. And then they have a little separator, a little divider. Oop. There's the divider. But they can swim freely back and forth. Just gives some of them a little more privacy. Oh yeah, there's Stanley. And Gladys. And that's one of the three stooges. I don't know which is which. Mo, Larry, Curly. Nope. Leave him alone. And then I have some quarry cats. Quarry catfish. And they hang out on the bottom. One of the babies Mark and I raised. From the legs. He scratched off the uh, side of the tank with a credit card, hoping to maybe hatch one. No, hatch is the right word, but we'll end up having like 40 and he gave several away. And then I couldn't part with them. I got attached to the little ones. So we got a second tank. <laughs> so we have a lot of catfish now. But they help clean the tank. And they're, they're, yeah, they're so sweet. These are thick-lipped garami. They're the sweetest fish. That's my female dwarf garami. Hard to find. And then he's a blood parrot. Cichlid. He's little now. We're gonna get bigger. And there's my dwarf Gorami now. And he's sneaking through. Oh, and there's my quarry cats. My panda quarry. I learned a lot, I'll tell you. A lot to learn. Freshwater, tropical fish. Almost a few fish in the beginning, but now I know a lot more. I haven't had any fish losses. So anyway, that's my tank. So far. It's a 29 gallon. It started with an impulsive uh, 5 gallon beta fish purchase. <laughs> it's very therapeutic.